WSTKS FM Worldwide, digital collaborative learning for the 21st century. Hello again, everyone. Professor Schwartz here in the WSTKS FM Worldwide Studios with another mug of coffee and Onyx the Cat hanging around in his usual spot on the back of my desk chair. Today, I'd like to say a few quick words about my favorite six apps for creating your collaborative journal article review and evaluation. Here we go. As a reminder, the first major collaborative project for the course asks student learning teams to use one or another article database through the Michigan State University website to find two journal articles less than 10 years old. The two articles your team selects should enable deeper understanding of and insight into some of the primary course materials examined during the first five weeks of the course in terms of power, oppression, equity, and justice. Gender, sexuality, race, ethnicity, class, and identity might be part of that. For your first collaborative project, your student learning team has three possible options. You should collaborate to develop either a TV newscast or talk show video, or an explainer animation, or a comic book or graphic novel. Whichever format your team chooses to present its work, Make sure to concisely review, assess, and appraise the usefulness of two recent journal articles, less than 10 years old, that pertain in some way to the materials you have examined during the first five weeks of the course. These could be films, novels, plays, or some combination thereof, depending on the course. Take a close look at the prompt in Project Packet Number 1 on D2L for additional information on this assignment. The neat thing about this project is that your student learning team can present its work in one of three possible formats, giving you voice and choice in how you create and share your new knowledge. Let's take a quick break now, and when we come back, I'll talk a bit about what these options are. See you in just a bit. Welcome back. In the first segment, I talked briefly about the journal article review, evaluation, and assessment your student learning team will carry out for its first major collaborative project this semester. Let's turn now to my favorite six apps for creating this particular project. First, your team could choose to use the WeVideo app to create a TV newscast or talk show format to present your article review, evaluation, and assessment. WeVideo is an online cloud-based video editing platform that works in both web browsers and on mobile devices. WeVideo is easy to use, fast and flexible, as mentioned on its website, enabling your student learning team to create a polished video that can be shared online and posted to your team's submission folder on D2L easily. If your student learning team chooses to present its article, review, evaluation, and assessment as a TV newscast or talk show, WeVideo makes it easy for you to create and share your work in a fun way. When we come back in just a moment, I'll talk about two more digitally creative apps that your student learning team might like to consider as you collaborate to develop your journal article review, evaluation, and assessment. Stay tuned! You're listening to WSTKS FM Worldwide Digital Collaborative Learning for the 21st Century. If you find this podcast helpful, be sure to hit like, share, and subscribe. Welcome back, everyone. Let's continue looking at two more of my favorite six digitally creative apps for your student learning team to consider as you prepare your review and evaluation of two recent journal articles. If your student learning team chooses to present its findings in the form of a brief explainer animation video, you might like to consider using either Movely or Powtoon to create it. 
Movely enables your team to create an engaging and customized video in any style in an easy to use way. The free plan allows you to create videos with Movely Studio that has more than 1 million stock images. You can easily publish your finished work to YouTube, Vimeo, and other online outlets, and you have up to 20 personal uploads free. The educational option for students includes everything in the free plan with the addition of 3-minute video length and up to 5 downloads or exports per month. Powtoon, the second online animation app that I recommend, enables your student learning team to create its animated explainer videos in an easy way thanks to its online editor tools. You can use Powtoon Educational to complete your explainer animation in just a few steps using hundreds of drag and drop images to help tell the story of your journal article review, evaluation, and assessment. In just a moment, I'll be back to talk about three additional apps that your student learning team might like to use to develop and share its first collaborative project. Stay tuned, everyone. Hello again. Before the musical break, we looked at Movely and Powtoon that your student learning team might use if presenting your journal article, review, evaluation, and assessment in the form of an animated explainer video. Now, let's look at three other apps you might use if presenting your review, evaluation, and assessment in the form of a comic book or graphic novel. First, there is Make Beliefs Comics, which empowers you to express your ideas and tell your stories for free. There is a tutorial to help your student learning team get started, along with loads of other options, including different languages, story ideas, as well as other useful features. Book Creator, another option your team might like to consider, gives a load of different options for creating interesting, engaging, and fun animations that you can share easily. Among others, you can add music, upload and drop in your own photographs or images, plus add shapes, icons, arrows, and emojis to help convey the information your team includes in its story. <laughs> that is your, your review. Significantly, Book Creator also enables your different team members to collaborate in real time. Following a quick break for a station identification, I'll be right back to talk about a third possible option your student learning team might like to consider if it chooses to present its article review, evaluation, and assessment as a comic book or graphic novel. Stay tuned! You're listening to WSTKS FM Worldwide Digital Collaborative Learning for the 21st Century. If you find this podcast helpful, be sure to hit like, share, and subscribe. And we're back. As a quick reminder, we've already looked at Make Believes Comics and Book Creator as two possibilities for presenting your journal article review, evaluation, and assessment if your team chooses to do so in the form of a comic book or graphic novel. Let me say a few quick words now about a third digitally creative app that I suggest might be interesting to use for this particular iteration of collaborative project number one. For just $9.99 US dollars, Storyboard That gives you thousands of customizable images, unlimited storyboards, layouts, and various options for print or export. You can also introduce audio to your work for added interest and overall impact. While not free, the cost of storyboard that split four or five ways might be just the creative tool for your student learning team to consider if it chooses the comic book or graphic novel option for this project. I'll be right back in just a moment with a few final words for today. All right, everyone, that will do it for this podcast on my favorite six apps for creating your collaborative journal article review, evaluation, and assessment project. 
There may be other readily available and easy to use apps out there that will enable your student learning team to develop and present its work as either a TV newscast or talk show, or an explainer animation video, or a comic book or graphic novel. Remember, though, that if your team finds a different app that suits your needs better for the purposes of this project, by all means, go ahead and use it. And do let me know so that I can update the information included here. But you might also look at WeVideo, Movely, Powtoon, Make Beliefs Comics, Book Creator, and Storyboard That before making up your minds. Having a range of possible options is always a good thing when it comes to your schoolwork or, indeed, life, the universe, and everything else. That will do it for today, then. Thank you for joining me this time and every time. I'll see you in class, online, <laughs> and during Zoom office hours if you drop by with a question. Have a safe and productive week in the meantime, everyone, with special regards from Onyx, the cat what am. So long, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye-bye, everyone. You've just heard a podcast from WSTKS FM Worldwide, digital collaborative learning for the 21st century.